Welcome to day number four of Expedition uh, Brock Face getting up there. Today's mission uh, it consists basically on getting a way around the, the killer wasp nest. Um, we've identified the species that I recorded yesterday and it's actually called Marimbon du Chapelle or something like that and it's not a killer wasp like we thought it was but it is venomous so uh, we spoke to our caretaker and he gave us two alternatives the first one kill it with fire so we probably just go with a torch or, or a flamethrower or something like that and uh, torch him to torch the whole hive uh, and try to get rid of it through that or his second alternative would be bashing it um, I'm using his own words uh, bashing it and running away right bashing and running away it's not uh, very recommendable to do because we are in an incline on a rocky side of the, of the mount already and there's nowhere to run so unless we just roll down the rocks and etc etc uh, not gonna happen is it we are, can't use the flamethrower up there because there's a lot of uh, dried leaves and dried trees etc and if we decide to use the flamethrower up there we're gonna burn half the Mata Atlantica in the property and that kind of defeats the point doesn't it so the solution we found is going around the nest and then finding out what we can do about it later with some type of poison or something like that which we're gonna have to find better where to get it from um, but for now we, got, we found a way around and Chris is up there in the wall I don't know if you can see it from see him from there just around here um, and we're going to be going around the nest quite a way around uh, where of course I'm going to be shine taking this torch up there and he's gonna shine it shine it over there so we can photograph it and find out exactly where we are how long we have to go all the way up so that's instructions for day two or day four sorry about that and here we go Woohoo! see you up there and where the I should be probably resting my leg but I'm actually probably more annoyed by the fact that they made their way up there and found the rock face and I wasn't there when they did it <sighs> anyway I to make my way then taking some pretty pictures yeah that's that's mom she has just seen her seen us from up high and she's scared for us and we're the ones with the killing marimbondos and stuff yeah yeah my goodness yeah mom is impressed of how high we are rock face but it's full of very flaky rocks which means we might have to be a little bit careful especially after it rains here or find another way down once we're up there but that's the fun isn't it adventure I managed to get to the first climbing spaces climbing faces actually and I'm now gonna have to give up. Chris and Dungy all the way up there on top. I don't know if you can see them over there. But I got to the first actual uh, footholds for the rock face here. And I'm gonna have to come back. 
go back to the house because my bloody knee and leg I have decided to give in. So for today I think the adventure is over for me. But I'm still happy. Ladies and gents, I got to the rock face. I'm just gonna try and snap some pictures here and head back down. Hooray! Far, far away. Just took some pictures of mum waving. Dear Lord Almighty, what a view. I really don't know you can capture all of it from the camera. <sighs> Loving having no foothold here. Been fun. Really a shame my bloody legs won't hold me. It's frustrating really, you know. I've been well enough to go and do that. Guess another hey day of, of resting for me and then gonna have another go. I just all there to climb again. But you know what? That's gonna be fun. Can wait for you guys to be able to come here. That's just making me very, very frustrated because I've just been told that they can see some one of the most beautiful sunsets from the top there in a perfect view of most of Situ Meteora and some awesome places for pictures and I'm having to make my way back yeah still here still going down just slowly but surely and Uh, don't, you don't think you can see me from there, I'm back in the jungle, just heading down. So yeah, tomorrow hopefully, make it down to the path up to Meteora. Uh, but I can't make it anyway up, so I have just called rescue. Which... I think I can hear it coming now. And I've managed to face plant on my way down. Because one of the rocks I was lost. Newbie's mistake. Rescue. To give poor me a ride. Say hello. It's gone without me! He then stay four for me. Do you, want us, do you want us to wait for you? So, this is how day number four ends for me. With a ride from mum going up again. Trying to see if Chris is coming with us. But up we go. Trying to do it again tomorrow. Because they're really good. Because we're just kind of stubborn like that. Right, Mum? Because we're leaving. Because we're leaving. Yeah.